It's a GRE quant practice question, a medium difficulty question from the topic averages and statistics. The average height of 20 students is 130 centimeters. If the tallest student and the shortest student are not counted, we are removing two students from the set of 20, the average drops by 0.5 centimeters. So initially it's 130, it will come down to 129.5. The difference in height between the tallest and the shortest student is 22 centimeters. We need to find out the height of the shortest student. Most of these averages questions can be fitted into the standard framework that we had discussed. The standard framework for averages comprises three columns. One of the columns is the number of elements in it. Second is the average. Third is the sum. Sum is nothing but the product of the first and the second column. Number of elements into average should give us the sum. Initially, we started with 20 students. Their average height is 130 centimeters. So some of their heights will be equal to the number 20 into the average 130. This is an easy number to calculate. This is equal to 2600. So sum of the heights of all 20 students equals 2600 centimeters. Now the heights of two students have been removed. So we'll be left with 18 students. The average drops by 0.5. The initial average is 130. So the new average is 129.5. This calculation probably would be better off doing it with a calculator. Let's quickly run through the calculator here. So we have 18 students and their average height is 129.5. The result is 2331. So 18 times 129.5 is equal to 2331. So for all 20, sum of height is 2600. For 18 out of these 20, the sum of the height is equal to 2331. So the height of the remaining two students, the students are the tallest and the shortest, will be the difference between these two. All 20, this is the height. For 18 of the 20, this is the height. So difference between these two, which essentially equals 269 will be the sum of the heights of the tallest and the shortest student. Let's quickly capture up till this in a printed form. Some of the heights of all 20, 2600. Some of the height of 18 of the 20, when the average drops by 0.5, is 2331. So difference between these two numbers will be the height of the two students, the shortest and the tallest. So tallest, let's say his height is T. The shortest, the height is S. T plus S equals 269. The question mentions the difference in their heights is 22. So tallest minus the shortest is equal to 22. What do we have to find out? We need to find the height of the shortest. We need to find the value for S. So subtract the second equation from the first one. So when you do that, T gets cancelled with T. S minus of minus S will leave us with 2S. This equals 269 minus 22, which is equal to 247. So height of the shortest student equals 247 divided by 2, which is equal to 123.5 centimeters. The shortest student's his height is, shortest student's height is 123.5 centimeters. Quickly do this bit also in a printed form. Tallest plus shortest, 269, we got it from the previous table. The question mentions tallest minus shortest equals 22. So equation 1 minus equation 2 will give us the answer for 2s, which is equal to 247. So shortest student's height is 123.5. Before you leave, I want you to do two things. One, sign up as a trial user for Visaco's online GRE course at online.visaco.com. Takes all of three minutes and two steps to get started. And lastly, subscribe to this channel, youtube.com slash visacogre. We keep adding newer questions, give you tips, tricks on how to crack the GRE.